What's going on and welcome back to another less than five minute gear review. And in this video, we're going to be going over the applied gear hybrid everyday carry belt. So this guy's going to run you roughly around 60 bucks. So it is pretty competitive when it comes to similar belts on the market, like the Aries that I have, as well as the T-Rex ones that I've ran in the past. So price wise, it is very competitive and very good. This belt is very, very simple when it comes down to it. There is not a whole lot to it. It's made out of nylon and it actually is folded over itself, so it is very rigid. I love belts being very rigid like that. It still has a little bit of flex in it, but when it comes to holding things that you may wanna carry for your everyday carry, like your pistol, mags, knives, lights, and mat or med kits, it does a really good job of holding those in place and not allowing those items to kind of want to pull away from your body and uh, from your pants and your belt. So I do think this thing is very well built. It is very, very simple. It is actually probably the thinnest belt that I have. It's right at or just under an inch and a half. Uh, so it is really easy to set everything up. And then even with this being folded over and sewn onto itself, it is still really easy to add things like mag carriers, pouches, and my holsters. So, uh, when it comes to the construction, you do have your adjustments on this side. It just loops right through the uh, uh, micro cobra buckle. You got your male end and then your female end. And then on this side, you just have a simple loop that's sewn into place to hold that female end in. So it's real easy, uh, or I should say real easy. It's just a very simple setup when it comes down to it. Uh, setting this up for like everyday use is real simple too. Uh, I prefer running things with loops or kind of the uh, the clips that you can kind of pull out and then slide onto your belt and then they just kind of pop back into place. Uh, whether you want to use these loops, clips, or something like the, uh, I believe it's the blade tag kind of fold over clamp type of a clip, uh, all of them work really well on this system. This is just what I have right now just to be able to show you how this is set up. So slides right on. And then same with your holster side. This actually slides and fits a little bit easier than the core, or yep, the core essential belt that I have. But uh, really, just kind of comes down to personal preference and how tight you want things. Uh, this is a little bit looser, a little bit easier. I always have a belt loop in between uh, these two sides, so I know that that isn't going to shift uh, when it's on my pants and on the belt. So. I haven't had a single issue when it comes to that with this or any of these parts that you see here uh, shifting around on the belt. They lock in place and I haven't had a single issue with them in that capacity. Uh, do take note though when it comes to sizing, you do need to be very specific with your sizing measurements so that way you don't order the wrong size belt. It is a pretty specific fit. Uh, this guy is actually just a little bit too big for me. That was my mistake on my measurements. but. Uh, when it comes down to it, this thing does very, very well, and I can actually still get this thing on and have it uh, set up and configured the way it needs to. So with that, uh, I highly recommend it. I think it is an awesome product. If you have any questions, please feel free, leave a comment. We'll answer any questions that you have. Like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.